it's amazing, like all Giddy Robin's painting. I think it has beautiful colors, mystery about it, movements, everything. This was the image from the uh, invitation, and I found it really intriguing. I wanted to come check out the show. Uh, it's kind of mysterious. I love scenes like this where you're like, who is this character? Where are they at? Uh, it's almost like a short story or the beginning of, of some story. Um, I love how loose the brush strokes are. There's, it has a little bit of, a, of an Alex Katz vibe to it. Um, there's a informality to the treatment that I really like, assuredness of the brush stroke. It's abstract but figurative. Um, it's really intriguing. Uh, I think it pairs well with another painting in the show, which is the one of the, the lake, the two people on the boat. Um, I think those are my favorite in this show. Very intriguing work. My favorite color in surrealist painting has got to be blue. I think it represents a lot of sadness, a lot of feelings. Um, it's a really deep color. It's really rich. The pigment's really rich. So it's got to be my favorite color. It would definitely influence my purchase. I think I, when I, if I were to buy a painting, I would like it to match what the furniture I have and things I have in my house. So blue would be my pick for sure. I'm introduce my dear friend, the painter Gideon Rubin, and this time he show about four years ago, and this is a new show he did in Los Angeles, and this time is much more calming and colors tone and very special and compare what he used to be doing in Europe and this is very very special exhibition of Gideon. This impression of this painting um, was actually loneliness but now that I've been taking a longer look at it uh, I get the sense that the woman is actually questioning more her direction in life because she's looking off into the corner um, so that kind of leads us to think that maybe she's pondering about her next step in life or reflecting on her choices in general. So that's just the impression that I get. Solitude, questioning, um, maybe connectivity to nature.